What is up, everybody? Vanzel of Vanzair, hailing to you out of the Vanzair hangar. Here, home of the uh, build that's happening. More information on that soon. Um, I actually am recording this process of this stuff going on here um, to be posted in another video. Actually, I'm in the middle of my uh, going between the times of me making this video. Well, the GoPro camera died. Um, so I'm charging the battery right now. But I have another package that came and I wanted to kind of do an unboxing a little bit and talking about it just a little bit. Um, something I needed to do for this hanger. Um, so what happens in this hanger when I when the door is closed, all cell cell signal um, pretty much ceases to exist. <laughs> so I get very weak, if any at all, uh, cell service, whether that's with my iPad or phone, because the uh, it kind of blocks it. Therefore, I got a cell phone antenna kind of booster. I have the proper name for it either in the title or uh, in the in the comments below so this came for me and i wanted to kind of do an unboxing for it and this is what i plan to use so i can actually have cell service and have um connection within the hangar when i close the door here in the in this region it gets cold so having the door open year round is not a really a practical option uh, so here on my kind of desk like i said i have my little camera that's I need charging, but I have multiple batteries and all my batteries kind of dead, so I kind of have that charging on its own a little bit. Man, the lighting is a little different in this right here. Anyway, so we have our kind of connection here. So it comes, so the idea of this is it's an antenna that I can put outside it'll pick up the cell phone signal and I can run that into inside the hangar so it can pick up the signal through the wire and I run a wire outside which I haven't exactly I've seen it done but I haven't exactly done it on my hangar thus far um, so let's see what we got here um, we have white box we have white cord. And I assume there is metal inside of that. We have cord of power here. And we have a book. I don't know who really uses these things. Um, we have this thingamabob and jig. We have metal poles here with some type of U thing. I guess this can be used for designs or something. I want to make it look pretty. We have a little plastic, a little plastic tube. Looks like a thermometer. We're going to call that thermometer. We have some useless parts, extra parts. And the most important thing, the bubble wrap. This is what we actually, this is actually what I wanted right here. All of that stuff, which is a byproduct, because I kind of wanted the bubble wrap here. Have you, it, it, the ultimate joy is if you twist it up and you just squeeze it and, okay. <laughs> All right, let's see what we have in here actually. So, I'm kind of putting this away on the side here. So in this we have our antenna. So this is the antenna, this is the mounted brackets to the pole, which I have to get, I haven't exactly made an idea of how I'm gonna do this. I don't know if I'm going to use a, a TV antenna or not. Um, I'm still deciding that process because I am one of those people that I don't even use TV at home. I just use the internet. Um, we have our antenna for our, in, for our box is going to be inside. We have our power cord for that. We have our, looks like cable line is actually antenna line. So this is how we uh, connect the antenna. So. I check with this kind of order the way this works. This antenna is going to be mounted outside using this cord. This cord is going to wrap from outside in here, pending um, my 
I'm gonna do it up there. So, um, cord, the antenna cord is gonna route from outside wherever I have it to wherever I place this box. This box is gonna have a power cord connected to it. It's gonna have this antenna so, it, so my cell phone can piggyback off of it. And that's kind of the process. So we have kind of mounty hardware for this one to mount it. I'm not screwing anything in here. Um, well, we may have a board. So that's what's kind of in here. The important user manual, which the first thing you should do when doing anything is pay attention to the user manual. So I'm gonna take my time and kind of go through this, see how I want to route it, see where I want to kind of place it among my uh, power extension cords and everything, and my knots up on the roof. But first, let's see if it's kind of first get it working, then go on from there. So here's kind of the picture of this one. So you have kind of a kind of a mounting pole here. That was another thing, a TV antenna isn't necessarily that expensive. And I can mount this to the pole that comes with the TV antenna. So I can have both. And then pick up HD satellite for the local station. So I guess just to have, you know, maybe some ambiance or different news playing or game playing while working on what this is for. If you don't know, it's going to be in one of the other videos. And... That's kind of the unboxing, and that's how we're. Thank you for taking the time to watch out, watch this video. Please like, comment, subscribe. Help me help you find the next best version of you. And remember, evolve the life you're in. You can be happy where you are, and evolve it into something better. Thanks, guys.